lads. Boys, we've just been to Apple in the Trapper Centre. Um, and they think they've fixed my phone. There's no crackling, so hopefully there shouldn't be any crackling in this video. I can't find where the fuck I parked, though. I think I'm over there. There she is. Being a good girl. Good girl. We're going and getting something done that we should have been done a long, long time ago. We might be getting something as well, if I can sweet talk him, but we'll see you boys, we'll see. I'll see you when I get there. God knows where the hell it is because I've got no data on my sat now, so you, your boy's just guessing, but your boy might have to use his sat now. We'll see. <laughs> Which I'm a little bit annoyed about. Yeah. Can't lift it up a bit. Yeah, literally. Just keep it in the back all the time, mate. In this world. We'll just put a whack on it. Cause, well, what do you normally do? Put it higher or lower than that? That's probably where the album. Yeah, I like that there. Yeah, that's a, do you want it to, you want it to be Yeah, I want it to be like, yeah, mine's, yeah. Mine, mine's quite low, mine's quite Is it? Yeah, no, it's good that, because I, I can still see, but it, I still get that race car feel. <laughs> And try and tell us what we cost him a tenner. <laughs> Are you sure, like, you know what we mugged off there? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I run away! Reaching for the stars, traveling so far, like a dragon. Game of football, he says, in these crepes. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I feel like so much more private, man. I had to feel like you, you can, you're in your own little place instead of just fucking everyone staring at you and shit. The shenanigans would be a lot safer, lad. <laughs> well more aggressive, man. Some strip. Five percent. Way more aggressive. So boys, we finally got our bloody window tinted. We also got the McGann badge took off and we also got a matte black sunstrip which looks sick back on a race car, boys. And I actually feel like I'm in my own place now instead of, you know, like everyone staring at me and stuff like this is, you know what I mean? It's very private now, it's very private. But I'm getting a really bad knocking noise and a clicking noise. Uh, when I go very light bumps on my driver's side, so I need to get home now, uh, get it all apart and have a look because I've j it just feels like we've not tightened something down enough. Uh, maybe it's a drop link, maybe it's a strut bolt going through the hub, but something is definitely not right on my driver's side. I need to make sure it's all safe uh, as long as everything's tight. Obviously, uh, if everything's tight and it's still making knocking, I know it's just a drop link because the drop link was a little bit knack when we got it off anyway, but uh, at least then I know that it's not the end of the world. Your standard lock with a tire is on. Let's get this wheel off. It is starting to rain a little bit, so hopefully I can hurry up. So our wheels were really, really, really loose. That might be a factor, but we're still gonna get the uh, still gonna get the car up and have a look. I actually can't see anything at first glance. I mean, drop link solid, top rod end solid, uh, that bolt's solid. I can't really tell anything just by the look of it, to be honest. But I'm just gonna torque everything down again to the right specs. 
I think I found the culprit, boys. Uh, it's a drop ring, although it looks tight. When you get a gun on it. It's actually spinning on a thread, so I'm gonna try and sit here with the rattle gun and maybe just hopefully bang it down, but I mean, I can't tighten it either because the thread, uh, the, the hex is a little bit, it's rounded off, so I can't actually stop the thread from spinning. I might actually, oh, I'm not really sure what to do here. Right, so in an attempt to tighten it, I'm gonna try, I'm not sure if the camera's gonna do well here, uh, there. I'm gonna try and get some mole grip just on the end bit there. I'm, try, I'm trying to try and not touch the ball joint with the mole grip, I'm just trying to get a on that and then hopefully that'll just stop it spinning enough to, to rattle it down. Really thin. Uh, I am going to need a new, new drop link after this um, but for the time being I just need to tighten it down. Uh, I'm going to try long those pliers, grabbing it and then rattling it. So I ended up getting it tighter with vice grip but that definitely, definitely, uh, definitely, if anyone knows that song, gigs, definitely. Definitely. Anyway, I definitely 100% need a new drop link. It was kind of, I kind of knew that I was going to get some anyway. I'm probably going to get some rated ones, or maybe it doesn't even make a difference if you get some rated ones. I'll probably just get some uh, like Lem Forder ones or TRW ones, uh, and I'll probably just grind them off. I mean, because. Fucking hell, some meat coming off that. Yeah, I'll probably just grind them off. I've got it a little bit tighter. Um, but definitely does need changing. Definitely does need changing. And I'm gonna put tighten my wheels down all the way. I think that was contributing to the to the issue as well. Man, she looks so much better with the sunstruck on and stuff. So much better. Five percent window tint. Five percent. The gam bag just gone. Oh mate, she looks well more aggressive. Yeah, so I got that from a guy called Simon in Wigan. Uh, he owns, he basically owns a, an image printing business, he owns winner tints and stuff like that. Uh, I've wanted to do that for so long, but basically all the prices that you, that I found were just outrageous for what they were. Like over like, you know, between like near enough 150 quid. Like, and then I found Simon who's over half the price of that. He's really cheap, he's really good, really nice guy. Uh, I'll leave all of his, uh, I won't leave his phone number because I don't know what you guys are like. Because <laughs> I've already had a, a, a few of you bloody prank calling me when I had my car in auto trader, you bastards. But I'll leave his Facebook and his Instagram. Give him a message, tell him what you want. I'll tell him I sent you. Uh, it'll sort you out. He is based in Wigan, so he's a really nice guy. Give him a message. If you want any tinting or any badges taken off or anything, some strips, any print stickers as well, so we can make custom stickers for you. Uh, yeah, give him a message. I mean, I can still hear that bloody noise. It's weird, it's like. So at least coming from the inside of my door somewhere, like maybe like, like my window cable is like, fuck knows, but it's so frustrating. It can't be my suspension because I've literally took everything on and put it all back together, like, literally can't be my suspension. Look at this dickhead walking right in front of the road. Hello, you're in the road. And he turns back and does the exact same thing. Wow. No, but I don't know, it, oh, it's going to annoy the shit out of me, that. At least now I know everything's tight and safe and nothing's going to fucking kill me, like. I'm going to the gym, lads. I'll see you soon. Lads, I forgot to tell you. When we was jacking up the car... Who's that Lucas head? We were jacking up the car before. The jack wouldn't fit under. That means we're low, boys. Means we're fucking low. Hey, so, boys, remember in the last video when I mentioned that uh, we were going to do a meet uh, in Wales, in Wrexham, we're going to drive around Wales. It's all set in stone. The 5th of November at 11 o'clock, we're going to meet in Wrexham. We're going to drive th round the all North Wales, uh, through Snowdon, and it's going to be a class. I've actually set up a Facebook page now, uh, so anyone can just go and like it and invite their friends as well. I'll leave a link in the description. I'll also put a little print screen here of what it's called. Link in the description, go like it, uh, and hopefully you can all make it. It'll be fucking class, lads. I'm going to lads, and I'm going to see if they're playing banter. In a free naan bread, how dare you? Let's see if they want to play games. They will. I think they will, mate. I think they will. I really do think they will. Well, if they don't, they're going to go on YouTube saying that they're terrible, so they're better. <laughs> it's here. Bloody didn't bring it. Didn't bloody bring it. Bastards. Oh, lads, I've just absolutely... Yep, it's cold. I've got my hood on like a scally. I don't care. And I sound like crap, but it's early. When you get a letter from the council, you're like, oh, my God. What the fuck have I been driving through now? Where have I been parking? And then it's an election letter. Like, fuck off. Don't scare me like that. Bam. Don't give me that. Don't scare me like that in the morning. I don't want that sort of stress when I wake up. Thinking I've got a bloody parking ticket. Jesus. What the hell is a traditional pasta?
the hell's that? Is that Cornish Cornish pasty? Tasty British minced beef with tur- I think it's a, a Cornish pasty, so I don't understand why that's changing it and go traditional pasty. The fuck is a traditional pasty? Is it traditional steak pasty? Is it a traditional meat pasty? Come on. Meat potato pasty? No, it's a Cornish pasty, don't like saying traditional. Uh, it's bulking season, isn't it, lads? So pasty for breakfast. It's bulking season. Whenever you, you want to eat crap and someone says anything, you just go, bulking season? You are chocolate for breakfast. It's bulking season, lad. What are you on about? Lads, I've finalised the design for the 10 case stickers. I'm going to put it on the screen now. That's what we're having. It's going to look clear. It's a lot cleaner than the last one. It's a lot smaller than the last one, so you can fit it uh, anywhere you want. It's like a more circular design instead of like a long cuff on. Uh, I have a lot of people asking me for hoodies and things. I am in the process of doing them. I just need to get the little design, not designs, but just the, the little tweaks left, like numbers and and how much going to order in, and then where we're going to put the logo and colours, etc., 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 etc. But they are in the making. So I know that a few of you have been actually been looking at it already, but this is the ten thousand case stick. We've got it in oil slick, uh, white, and then obviously a matte black. I think it looks so much cleaner, so much cleaner. And then try to keep them as cheap as possible for you guys uh, and obviously as best as possible as well so i'm trying to wiggle my work trying to wiggle my magic with some printers trying to get some good discounts for everyone okay so it's email and then one of the printers now uh, so yeah I'm, I'm i'm getting 250 to start off 125 by 75 i'll sit 50 matte black um <clears throat> i think that's a good start i mean probably sold around about 300 of the 5k stickers um and that was probably that was over the course of about a month, well, probably about a month or two. Um, and so now we're double the followers, so I'm ordering around about 300 stickers. I can always get more, uh, but I think that's a good starting point. Right, we need to go and measure and take a picture of Maya's new sunstrip, because she's getting a customization thing. I'm going to tell you what it is. I'll just show you when it comes, but we need to measure that sunstrip. And then I need to measure it, take a picture with the measurements, and then... I'm gonna get on the Photoshop and we're gonna make some stuff because, well, you'll see it, man. Not long it's gonna take, but I think it'll be next week. It's, it's gonna be cool, boys. She's so long. All right, so I need to measure this window on the quick time. It's about 47 inches wide. 47 inches wide, okay. I'm gonna get a quick picture and then I'm gonna get on Photoshop. Well, I'm gonna break the surprise, lads. I'm getting a custom uh, sticker made for Maya. A company reached out to me and said, hey, we want to we want to congratulate you on, on almost hitting 10k. Uh, we want to make you a, a custom sticker for Maya. So I want something uh, on the on the windshield banner relating to my YouTube channel. Um, I have put, I've made two designs. Can't decide between two of them. So I put a poll on my Instagram story. Uh, so if you're not got me on Instagram, go follow me on Instagram. I put a little quirks like that all the time. But yeah, these are the two designs. Something like that with that's little lock with all the neochrome cost there. Or something a little bit sleeker with... LW and then YouTube.com um, slash it's Lee Lockwood. At the minute, guys, I don't know which one I prefer. I think I kind of prefer that one, but everyone on the story is wanting that one, so I'm gonna go with what you guys say. I'm gonna uh, in about later on tonight. I'm gonna actually post the the results of the poll on here, so you know I'm not lying to you. Right now, boys, it's gin time, sub bed time. We've got a butler and job later. Just been scrolling from my Instagram and I've just seen that one of my old pictures on like 930 odd likes, so I've literally just begged on my Snapchat for everyone to like it and please I just I just wanna I just want a picture of a thousand likes. Walk past everyone on the street. Excuse me, mate. Got a thousand likes on Instagram. See you later. But hopefully by the time YouTube is seeing this video, it'll be it will be on a thousand. But if it's not, I will oh my god, this is absolutely begging. This is begging this man. This is begging. Well if it's not, then I'm gonna Leave a little link in the description to that video. And please go like it, lads. Hashtag get Lockwood to a thousand likes. Eight more likes away. Come on. Way, we're a thousand. Way. Yes, lads. Thank you, everyone, on my Snapchat and my Instagram for for liking it. You're the best. Thousand, thousand likes on Instagram. You know what I mean? If I had got a gold crown around my head. You know what I mean? What, mate? Shut up, man. I've got a thousand likes on Instagram. Well, what a better way to end the video there on a bloody hype. I don't know why I'm so buzzing about it. It's only fucking likes on Instagram. Whatever, lads, thanks for watching. I'm not sure how long this video is going to be because it's actually over a couple of days, but they're all, it's all been really short footage. But I hope you enjoy it nonetheless. I've tried to keep it longer. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching, lads. 
I'll see you next time. Next big milestone, 10,000 subs. Stickers are ready. Can't wait. Hold on, hold on to